Hey, hey friends, y'all guess what time it is. It is that cash envelope stuffing. As y'all can tell, we've got all of our money. There's $750 and we're gonna break it down and tell you all where it came from. <clears throat> so we have our cash, we're gonna set off to the side. We have our envelopes here. These are our bills. I did set up a new way of doing the bill. Seems that we do track all of those and our expenses. So all of those are in here now. Oh, I spelt that one wrong. Oops, I'm going to have to fix that. Okay, but we got all these in here and I got a few blank ones just in the back just to make sure I don't forget anything else. So we do have these. We're going to set that off to the side. And this is our sinking funds. As y'all know, this month we are still stuffing several of our categories, car maintenance, car tags, and Christmas are three priorities at this moment. <clears throat> so we are stuffing those. All right, so we're going to set that to the side and we're going to first do our paycheck breakdown so we know what is going into each of these categories and how much the paycheck ended up being. We're going to zoom in. All right, so James's paycheck for this week was $723.25. All right, I didn't bring anything in this week. So on other, we have 27.44. And if y'all have ever heard of the Get Up Side app, you download, it's an app on your phone, you download it and it pulls up gas stations and it discounts like some gas prices and it gets it back to you. So I cashed out at 27.44 the other day, which gives us a total of 7.50.69. All right. So this is how much we have to work with for this week's breakdown. So for all of these, they're going to be the same all the way down for pest control. From Mazda down to pest control are going to be the same as they have been for the first week. Savings and debt will be different. So let's go ahead and fill this in. We've got 120 for the rent and Mazda. 100 for groceries. 39 for Allstate. 28 for AT&T. Power is 26, gas is 24, spending is 20, water is 16, diapers is 16, charter is 14, student loans is 12, miscellaneous is 10, and pest control is 7. All right, so adding all this up, we still have remaining $198. So I'm splitting it in half between savings and debt. So 99 is going for savings and 99 is going for debt. And I'm not sure. Let's see if I can get my calculator close enough so y'all can <clears throat> see me do the math. We're going to add this up. So... All right, so our total is the $750, which matches here. The cents just stay in the account for right now. All right, so that is our total. $750. All right, so now we're going to move this to the side, and we're going to pull out all of our envelopes and start stuffing them. All right, so first out, we need our bills and expenses. <clears throat> envelope envelopes all right and we're going to lay out our cash all right so let's lay out all of our cash <clears throat> okay so we got our ones over here we got our fives Our tens and twenties <coughs> and our one hundreds. All right. So there we go. All right. So first up is the Mazda, and Mazda gets one twenty. So one twenty. We're gonna add this, and this does have the extra seventy five from last week. So now we have. 1, 2, 20, 40, 60, 80, 3, 10, 15, 
So there's 315 in this one so far. All right, rent gets 120. For rent, we have 120 in there. So that gives us 240. All right, for groceries, gets 100. And there's 100 in, so that's 200 for groceries. All right. I like them in here to keep them from my kids messing with them, but to stuff them, it is not as easy. So we're gonna pull them out and this one here. All right, so we're gonna pull them out and then we'll put them back in where we're done. So all state, we need 39. So 20, 30, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. And I will be switching out smaller bills to make larger bills. So, all right. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, so we need a five. We got two fives there, we'll get a 10. We've got two 10s, we'll get a 20. Okay. All right, so we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 76, and 778. So 78 for Allstate. And the only reason I'm switching them out is because I need some smaller bills for the sinking funds because I had to go through the ATM and switch out some bills so I could get smaller ones. So I just want to make sure I have plenty of small bills to put into sinking funds so I can evenly spread it out some. For our AT&T, we need 28. So 25, 26, 27, and 28. We are a month ahead. I do like to tell that in every video. People do ask why. There's still money in like groceries and things. It is because we are a month ahead and these are for our August. So let's see what we have. We have 20, 40. We can get a 10. Three, four, five. Okay. So now we have 20, 40, 55, 56 for AT&T. So there's that. Next up we have power and power gets 26. So 25 and 26. Okay, and we're just gonna trade out that for a 10. All right, so power now has 20, 40, 51, two. power. Next up is gas and gas needs 24. So 20, 1, 2, 3, and 4. And that gives us a lot of ones here. So let's see. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3. Okay. All right. For gas, we now have 20, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48. For gas, for spending, and this is for me and my husband, whatever we end with in the month, just to divide it in half and we each get half of it. So we have 20 we're adding to this. And there is 20 already, so that gives us 40. There's that one. Next up is water, and water gets 16. So 10, 15, and 16. Alrighty, so we're going to do a 20, alright, so for water we now have 20, 30, 1, 2, so there's water, and these are all my envelopes I created, I put together and made, diapers is 16, so 16, go.
All right, so we're also going to trade out this and get a 20. All right, so we now have 20, 30, 1, and 2. For diapers, for charter, we're putting 14. So 10, 11, 12, 13, and 14. Right. So we're going to get a 20 for the two tens and one, two, three, four, five. So for charter, let me straighten up this money so we don't be getting confused. All right, so we have 20, 25, 26, 27, and 28 for charter and student loans is spelled incorrectly y'all don't look at it here I'm, I'm going to pull it off can't believe I messed it up oh and as y'all can tell I'll use labels that I can pull off and it doesn't leave any marks all right, so this is student loans. I'm going to have to relabel it. It gets 12. So 10, 11, 12. All right, so we're going to do a 20 here. So 20, 1, 2, 3, and 4 for student loans. And I absolutely love the colors of a Galaxy one. All right, next up we have miscellaneous and it gets 10. So it makes 20, so we're gonna switch that out. Miscellaneous, I definitely wanna have a high bill in so it keeps me from not spending it throughout the next month. So I do wanna work towards making sure that's a high bill. And this last one here that's not labeled as well is pest control and it gets seven, so five, six, seven. And let's see what we have. Now we have 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, and 14. All right. So that is $14 for pest control. Okay. All right. So now we have all of those stuffed. We are going to put those back in our folio here. All right, so 99 of what's left here <clears throat> is going to our debt that we're working on paying off, which is our Mazda. So we're going to go ahead and pull out 99. So we have 20, 40, or we'll do 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99 so let's see 20 40 60 70 80 90 95 96 97 98 99 all right so we're going to add that to Mosta here and see what we have come up with now 